What's up, YouTube? I am back. It's your boy, Scott Free, and this is The Sounds of Sunday.
And yes, coming back, there was a nice little cut by John Daly with Beer Belly Blues. Nice little uh, reggae blues. I mean, not reggae, but uh, um, blues. <laughs> I'm back on the show, so I'm acting a little silly. But that's, that's a little um, blues track. From before that was Ferris Wheel, and that one was by Quincus Morita. Ferris Wheel. Um, before that was one by Joe Bega with Mouths of Prince. And that's another correction I want to give out to um, Joe Bega. I kept saying um, that track was called Mouths in Prince, uh, but it's called Mouths of Prince. So uh, shout out for correction for, uh, to Joe Bega for my mistake on that one. And like I said, on top of the charts today was one by Diamond and Tease was Respectagize. Not Respectagize, Respectagize. All right. Right here on the Sounds of Sunday. I am your host, Scott Free. I am back from my two week, uh, two weekend in a, in a row vacation. Like I said, I got some camping equipment, so I'm actually taking out with some friends, getting ready for the summer season. Uh, we're going to be going doing a lot of camping, a lot of fishing, um, and have you uh, recreation stuff <clears throat> up and down the coast and the um, lakes and forest areas. Uh, okay, because I got nice little, uh, nice little camping equipment. It's easy to tow behind, you know, tow behind trucks and stuff like that. So <clears throat> uh, we had a great time out the uh, last two weekends. And anybody actually wants to uh, like to do outdoors, so, um, you need to get you some camping equipment and be ready for the summer. It's going to be pretty good this pretty hot this year. OK, um, so best place to be is out and about doing some camping, some fishing and relaxing. His family and friends. Okay. So, anyway, I am your host, Scott Free, and this is the Sounds of Sunday. Coming up on my smooth jazz music mix. Um, on top of the chart today is one by Nora at Blog B with Quandrine Cream. Quandrine Cream. Nice little uh, smooth jazz cut. Hope you enjoy. Right here on the Sounds of Sunday on this April 25th, 2021 show. Right back.
Yes, that was a nice little cut by the, the whole other with Night Driver. Nice little track. Before they heard one by Young Logos with Memory Rain. Uh, hope you like that track from Young Logos. And before that was one by Offshane with Cablario. 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 Okay. Oh, shame. And on top of the charts for Smooth Jazz Music Mix today was one by Nora Outblock V with Wandering Cream. That's so track. I am your host, Scott Free, and I am back from my two week uh, in a row vacation. Like I said, I've been out camping with some friends, um, enjoying myself out uh, with my little brat, uh, Bree. We've been out <coughs> enjoying it good air and getting ready, uh, getting the camping equipment ready for the summer. We go up and down the coast and also um, in some RV <coughs> lots and stuff like that. We really had some fun this year. Okay, getting ready. Um, actually, I wanted to actually give us a note. I know before actually the, the two weekends in a row, I mean two weekends I have been on air, um, I, just, I wanted to give um, some information. I know I talked about the vaccines um, and how they are not uh, vaccines. And people, uh, for some reason, people, um, they are still considering this a vaccine uh, when it's not. Um, so, like I said, be careful. Um, do your research, okay? Because you're not getting a vaccine. You're getting something else. I don't want to disclose that. Like I said, um, if you want any more information, go to our doctor, uh, Dr. Sherry Tenpenny, okay, she's one of the leading uh, <clears throat> uh, virus um, doctors, and just uh, download her information on her blog, and she will tell you all about it, and also we have doctors from around the world that's actually saying the same thing, um, that this is not a vaccine, and even the people actually who have manufactured this, okay, they have manufactured saying that it's not a vaccine. 
So be very careful and do your homework, okay? Because people are taking these vaccines, well, these jabs, okay? I call them jabs. But they're taking these jabs and not knowing what kind of state that they're putting their body through, okay? This is a humanity, a humanitarian issue right now. And I am, uh, besides me being a veteran, I am an expert, okay? I've studied five years in one of the top research universities, okay? And starting studying politics and humanities and arts, okay? And this humanities and political is right down my alley. So I'm actually here trying to let people know that when you go in to get these uh, jabs, you, you, you're getting what's what's actually being said as being a vaccine, but you're not, you're not getting a vaccine, okay? So be very careful and do your research, okay? Because I already have friends, uh, probably family, who's already went out and got this jab. And they had no idea which Dr. Tim Penny is saying <clears throat> what's going to happen within the next six months to a year uh, after people are actually getting uh, these vax, I mean, these uh, jabs. And there's also information coming out uh, that actually is starting to ramp up that people who actually have, that have actually had the vaccine is, uh, vaccines, these jabs, are now spreading diseases for two people with has who has not taken the jab uh there's women pregnant women that actually um this got made matter of fact discussing it and there's also other people who are discussing it that they're talking about these people who's gotten the jabs are being uh transmitters of um of transmitters of the disease okay so that's kind of strange to me but i'm doing more research on it and i'm listening to more doctors is actually a more um, citizens women especially women complaining about this they're also almost on the verge of saying be careful of people around you that actually are have been taking a jab because they're spreading diseases to transmissions i'm not sure if that's correct but at the same time it's ramping up where people more people are actually uh reporting that they have actually experienced this okay so like i said uh, you can't use the word vaccine because it's not a vaccine, okay? Legally and medically, the people who actually manufactured this is finally admit to the fact that it's not a, it's not a vaccine. And be careful. You're, you do your, do your, please do your homework. Research. You're going out there just because peer pressure and you're going out there because everybody else seems to be taking it. So you don't want to be left out of the crowd, which I think is kind of crazy. Um, because you have to start, you have to really think for yourself, okay, your lives and your spirit also, okay, so anyway, enough on that, coming up is my last music mix of the day, it is my international music mix, on um, top of the charts today for my international music mix is one by Nana Wabina with She No Doll Beat, right here on the Sounds of Sunday.
And yes, coming back, that was a nice little cut by Josh Lippitt and the Overtimers with Royale. Before that, you heard one by Aaron Lieberman, Abe Lieberman with Take a Break. And before that was Rubber Dub by Matt Harris. Nice little track. And like I said, on top of the charts for the day for my international music mix was one by Nana Kobina with She No Doll Beat right here on the Sound of Sunday. I am your host, Scott Free. I want to thank everybody for tuning in this afternoon on this 25th, Sunday, 25th, 2021 show. Like I said, I'm actually, I'm still here. I've just been um, out camping for the last couple weekends, um, having a good time with, with some friends, uh, getting ready for the summer, okay? I'm hoping you all have a good time and getting ready for your summer. Uh, most of a lot of stores and stuff are opening up. Now the parks are opening up, and I understand why is because the they don't want to lose these summer dollars, okay? Because that means the, the economy will be shot if they actually keep this lockdown <coughs> and this um, these lockdowns and these pandemics going, okay? Um, so they're looking for the summer dollars, which is going to save them for the year, okay? Uh, so I understand why they're opening it up. A lot of the restaurants and bars and stuff. And what's strange about it is they're still trying to tell people that's actually taking these jabs that they still have to wear their masks and they still have to, um, they have to so still have to social distance. I don't understand any of it because uh, what what are they? Who are they protecting from themselves who got the jabs or from people who hadn't? Okay, those are people who hadn't got, you know, did the social distancing and masks, not getting sick. But the ones that are taking the jabs are getting sick. And they're telling you, even though you've gotten the jab, they're telling you to still wear your mask and still practice social distances. Okay? N strange to me. Anyway, I'm your host, Scott Free. I will see all of you back here next weekend, right here on the Sounds of Sunday. Later. Oh, <laughs>